right, now we're going to show you how to edit this template. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to fast forward on our timeline a bit so we can see some of our 2D elements. And we're going to right click to select. We're going to go up into the material section and we're going to change the color of this material to blue. This way your material is blue. So now we're going to right click on the text. We're going to press tab. I'm going to erase the text and type my custom text. And then that's how you can put your custom text there. And then you just right click and you do the same with these. Now to change the color of your text, you can go into the node editor and you change the color of this emission right here. And you can change the color of it to any color you like. And now you can fast forward on the timeline and do the same with the 2D elements and change the colors of all of the 2D elements. Now we're going to show you how to save this template. So we're going to go into the camera section here and we're going to change the output. And you're going to click any folder on your computer and then you're going to press accept. And then you're going to go up here and you're going to press render animation. So that's it. This is how we show you how to edit this template. Don't forget to subscribe to Part News and Coordinated Rendering of Ideas, Motion, and Effects. And follow us on Twitter at The Criminal Adam and on Instagram at Partners in Crime GFX. Thanks for watching.